Shambles. This garage and is in absolute shambles. <sighs> okay guys, two things before this video gets started. One, I'm cold, I need a jacket. Two, I need a tripod for this. Alright, tripod set. I need a jacket. Alright. Oh, okay. Uh, is everything working on this camera? Cool. What's going on everybody? So, uh, no rec bike rebuild today. And uh, we got a lot of reasons why. Let me, uh, let me just tell you the... Alright, so why is there no rec bike rebuild today? Well, uh, I've got everything I need to work on the ZX-10 except for one very important thing, and that's the camera. The one you're watching, the thing I'm recording this on, is my B-roll camera. It's not, not my B-roll camera, but like my B-cam, the camera I go to like for backup or whatever. And uh, that's because I'm changing camera systems. I don't really want to go into it in a lot of detail in this video. I know a lot of you guys are here for motorcycle stuff, and justifiably so, this is a motorcycle YouTube channel. Uh, but because of reasons, I'm having to change, not having to, I've chosen to change my camera system. Uh, if you guys are interested in that video, let me know in the comments, and maybe I'll make an entirely separate video of like what camera we're switching to, and why we're mo moving to that one, and all that kind of stuff. But uh, the reason I'm telling you that is because this is the B-roll camera. It's, it, do, it does a really good job for what it does, but it's not what I need for a rec bike rebuild filming. So I have my old camera that I used to record on boxed up and I'm selling it on Amazon and doing the whole like little seller thing and my new camera comes in tomorrow. I'm filming this on Monday. Uh, it's gonna come out on Tuesday. So don't have the camera just yet, but there will be an episode of rec bike rebuild next week. And it's okay, because here's why. If you're on the Patreon page, I've talked about this many times, but I don't want to put out more than three episodes of Wreck Bike Rebuild per month. Normally there could be four, but I've decided I don't want to do more than three because I the way Wreck Bike Rebuild works is uh, my patrons are charged every single time a video is put out. So if I put out four videos a month, it could get really expensive for certain people and I want, because everybody kind of gets paid on that like monthly basis situation. So I, I try to keep my videos to only three a month with a minimum of two. That's kind of like my yearly goal. So I'm skipping this week because of all this camera bull crap and I will be back next week for the third video in February. That way we're gonna kind of keep up with this whole like three videos per month thing. Also, Let's just say there's no shortage of content for the Rec Bike Rebuild series. Uh, if you guys are on the Patreon page, by the way, last week was Valentine's Day on Wednesday. Wednesday's when we do our weekly live stream for Patreon. And uh, didn't do that because it was Valentine's Day. Obviously, my life is far more important than a live stream. Love you guys, though. But uh, because of no live stream on that week, we're actually going to be, I'm going to be showing you guys what's inside these boxes on tomorrow's live stream on Wednesday. So if you are not on Patreon and you are interested in, oh, those boxes. I, I can't even talk about it, get too excited. So <laughs> I would highly recommend you check it out because a lot of info. We're gonna be unboxing that stuff on the live stream tomorrow. Should be a really good time. Wreck Bike Rebuild is about to get ramped up so fast. It's good times. Anyway, so yeah, if you're interested in Rack Bike Rebuild, it's always a good time to check out Patreon and participate on the live streams. We try to do them every Wednesday night that we have a Rack Bike Rebuild episode that came out on Tuesday. But it's gonna work out since I didn't do one last week and I don't have an episode this week. Everything, everything just works. So there's probably a chance that you guys are wondering why my face is blistered to hell 
and they're shit. All over the garage. Well, there's a reason for that. And it's another reason of why there's no rec bike rebuild today. So, as a lot of you guys know, I film Rec Bike Rebuilds on Sundays. That's just the way my schedule and Heather's schedule works out to be the best day. Uh, this last Sunday, Heather, my buddy Bo, and I spent all day Sunday filming for Any Ridden Sunday. Any Ridden Sunday is my little documentary series that I am working on that is coming along so good. I am so excited. Uh, brief description, Any Ridden Sunday, I'm doing mini documentaries on motorcycle riders and showing them and how they ride. We're working on episode one and these are really high cinematic videos, my professional level content. Still working on where I'm gonna post those, but we're currently filming episode one. Here's a very short clip of something we got. Okay, that's all, that's, that, that's all you get to see. Uh, if you're interested in more of that stuff, it's gonna be posted on Any Ridden Sunday's YouTube channel. There'll be a link down below, right, probably under the Patreon link from what I was talking about earlier. So, we were out filming that all day Sunday. That's what happened to this. Also, look at my neck. I really hope it shows up as red as it was last night because I am burnt to hell because I'm not tan and being outside filming all day That'll burn you. All right, Daytona, you gotta, let's, let's move this gravy train. Okay, final thing I need to talk about. Is this focusing on my face? God, I can't trust it. Final thing we gotta talk about in this video is, you guys know I do gear reviews. I, I review motorcycle gear, and because of that, this has happened. This giant gear rack is packed full of motorcycle gear and I don't need any of it. I need a couple pieces obviously because I ride but like the majority of the stuff I don't need. So I think what I'm going to do to alleviate that issue is I'm going to take the gear I don't uh, need here and throughout the garage there's a couple things here and there that it's just taking up space and I, I have no use for it. So what I figured I would do is do like a c 2 dub garage sale. So I'm gonna make a page on my website. I'll put a link in the description. There's gonna be a lot of links down there, so have fun navigating all of them. If you're local to Atlanta, I would love to sell you stuff I have for like stupid cheap. I'm not trying to make a ton of money off my stuff. I just want it out of the garage. As I told you, I do gear reviews. I've got a lot of gear reviews coming up this year, and I need space. So, if you're interested in getting some cheap gear, I don't really want to do all the shipping and all that kind of crap, but if you're local to Atlanta and you want some gear for a really good price, check the link in the description. I'll make it a little C2Dub garage sale situation. I've also got those monster fairings that I need to send out of here. Anyway, check the link. All my stuff that I'm trying to get rid of is down there, and hopefully we can get rid of all this stuff and make some new uh, room for new gear for 2018. Boom. Good God, this camera is hard to use in this tiny little garage. Sorry, there's a screen on the side. That's what I'm, I'm looking at. Anyway, uh, so to sum up this video, uh, Patreon for Rec Bike Rebuild, gonna be dope. Make sure to sign up so that you can watch the live stream on Wednesday and see what's all in the boxes. It's awesome. Uh, Any Ridden Sunday is coming along swimmingly. Like, I wanted it to be here, and based on the current videos we're getting, it's like right here. It's going to be awesome. Make sure to subscribe to that channel. And if you want to buy gear very cheaply and you live in the Atlanta-ish Georgia area, I might ship the stuff and it's only going to be in the U.S. I ain't shipping to you guys across the pond because like so much money to ship shit. No thank you. Uh, check out the garage sale link down below. Uh, there will be a first ride later this week. Very excited. Hashtag Ninja 400, doing that tomorrow. And there will be a Rec Bike Rebuild episode next week. I appreciate you guys understanding the update video and trust me, this next camera, gonna be dope. Very excited for it. Again, if you guys wanna see an entire video talking about from my perspective, my perspective only, 
why I'm moving camera systems, what I used to use, what I'm currently using, and what I'll use next. Uh, let me know let, in the comment down below. I appreciate you guys sticking through me with a freaking update video. I know update videos aren't really exciting, but occasionally they are useful. That's all I got for you. Good times. Lots of awesome things ahead that I look forward to. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the like button if you like update videos. I don't know. I'm Chase on Two Wheels. I'll see you on the next one. Something probably just broke. Bye. Okay. Oh, it's Heather. Maybe. Are you? <laughs> Wait, hold on. I don't know if they can see you. <laughs> are you, are you dressed in a, a, can be in a video? No. No? Okay. Well, she's not able to be in a video, so I'm gonna leave outro crew. Wait, babe, say, say hey to the outro crew. Put your arm out, like wave or something. All right, you guys got to check out Heather. Okay, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching the end of the video. Make sure to hit the like button and bye. Okay, bye.